welcome back to my channel welcome to another glam life video today i have my new york fashion week vlog i'm so excited to share this video with you guys because like every new york fashion week i have the best time and i have the most amazing experience so i'm going to share with you guys everything that happened but before we get started on this video if you guys don't know who i am my name is arika i do some beauty fashion and fitness videos here on youtube so don't forget to subscribe to my channel click on the subscribe button below and also make sure to keep in touch with me on all of my other social media platforms so today's video is a new york fashion Fashion week video I know I've done so many of those kind of vlogs but you know every time I go it's such an amazing and crazy and cool experience so I am so grateful for all of you guys for following me for all of these years today I actually wanted to share with you guys the sponsor for this video and it is dossier I love fragrance you guys know that I always have different perfumes oh my gosh and when I went to New York Fashion Week this time I brought a whole fragrance and I used all of it so I want to show you guys the newest one that I got this is from dossier and Dossier creates designer dupe fragrances which are so amazing because I use my fragrances like so fast and so like heavy I always spray my friends I always have it in a bag I love fragrance I always touch up with fragrance I use fragrance literally all of the time and whenever I have a special scent that I have at that time I have so many memories of it so this one is gourmand white flowers and I actually picked this from dossier because it is the designer dupe for Victor and Rolf's flower bomb and I used flower bomb for so long I still use it I love it I always go back to it it's like my go-to fragrance it's very very girly and it smells so good so the top notes are bergamot green tea freesia and berries and the middle notes are white flowers orchid and rose and the base notes are musk patchouli caramel and vanilla and it smells so so good so this one is the dossier one and it is $29 you guys dossier is like where you get your fragrances you should get your fragrances there because it smells exactly like the designer fragrance for literally a fraction of the price and when you go to places like fashion week when you go out with your friends you get ready you have this and it's like you can spray all your friends you can smell so good and spray so many times and you aren't like spending so much money or worrying so much about like a 500 hundred dollar bottle of fragrance so i love dossier like this scent reminds me of the times that i used to go out all the time in la and all the times that i shared with some of my best friends and all the videos i used to make it just reminds me of that time so i'm just so excited to have this scent again and i'm gonna wear this tonight when i go out but i want to share that with you guys and i also wanted to create a little introduction before my new york fashion Fashion week video because this fashion week was so amazing I mean every fashion week is so amazing but I learned a lot about myself and exploring the city and I stayed in Tribeca this time and now I'm like I kind of want to live in Tribeca so bad it is so beautiful and so chill and so gorgeous and I shot some amazing photos so I'm gonna show you guys everything from right here on so I hope you guys enjoy this New York fashion week video Hey guys, oh my gosh, I'm in New York, can you tell? So I wanted to start a glam life vlog, obviously, so I have to do it for New York Fashion Week. So I don't know if you guys can hear me because it is always loud in the city, but I'm here in New York for New York Fashion Week. I just landed this morning, I took a red eye, so kind of sleepy, I got to lie flat, so it was like kind of comfortable, but then also like you only get to sleep like three hours, like max. So I'm here in the gorgeous. New York City and I'm about to go to my first event for Fashion Week. I have so many things, literally something every hour. So my first thing is the Amazon showroom right here at the Standard Hotel. Ugh, glam Life vlogs are back and this is full Glam Life for New York Fashion Week. So let's go inside. I'll show you guys what's inside. I'm so excited. Got a bunch of clothes. Heading to my next place. But 
I'm at the Nicole Miller showroom. Second stop. I already went to Amazon, got so much stuff. And this is my second stop going in here. Cannot wait. They're not actually doing a show this season. They're doing one next season, which is in February when it's really cold, but getting some clothes to wear. So excited. It's like yeah. she, what's nice is it's like the flare on the bottom, but then it's like tight in the middle, which are really flattering. I'm selling a Lauren dress. With a so cute, dress. yeah, in a different color. Yeah. Oh, the Mine white's cute well. too. This is a romper that literally is the most comfortable romper ever, and it's so cute on. Our Hazy Beauty Maxi. We have our Radiant Aura like mini dress. First outfit at Nicole Miller. Trying on different outfits. Wow, I'm gonna show you guys in the mirror. This is how it looks. I love it. It's very like classy, elegant in the back. Oh, I love trying clothes on. I actually just love clothes. And it like snatches your waist. You guys, I'm in my hotel. I got back to my hotel after I went to the Amazon showroom and then the Nicole Miller showroom. I got so many goodies, so I'll be unboxing it and showing you guys that later. Right now, I'm gonna take a little nap. I have my room, oh my gosh, you guys. The bed, it's like heaven right now. It's a really cute little hotel. I'll probably do a room tour later. It's it's small. I mean, it's not as small as some other hotels I have stayed at. I've stayed at many New York hotels. It's like small, but I can do it. You know what I mean? Oh, oh my gosh, you guys, I'm so happy to be here. That's my little New York view. And yeah, I'm gonna take a little nap and then I have a photo shoot later. And then I'm gonna go to a show, a presentation and then I have the sex party. So that's what I'm gonna do, but I'm gonna take a nap right now. Good night, guys. Okay, New York Fashion Week day one outfit. What do you guys think? I feel like it was like low-key made for me, but it is so tight. I like, you can't really walk big stuffs in it, but I am obsessed. So before I head out to the sax party, I need you guys to help me decide, should I add the gloves for the whole look or have it without? I'm gonna put the other one on and you guys let me know because I don't know. Oh, I love this dress. It's not even a dress, it's actually a corset and a skirt. But, do you guys like it with the gloves? Or without? Okay guys, so I just got back from the sex party. Literally, I have not taken off my makeup or shoes or anything yet. I just wanted to vlog before I came home. I took a bunch of videos on my phone. I'm just so sleepy, like I'm ready to just go to bed because I slept on the plane like three hours, three and a half. Like the flight was like four hours and something, but there was food and then I just, you know, slept the rest of the way, but there was like not enough time to sleep eight hours, obviously. So. I'm going to bed. My outfit literally is like probably one of my favorite outfits ever. So my room is like a little bit of a mess because I unpack like so fast and I just have it all crazy. So I don't want to show you guys, but this is the fit. I took a bunch of TikToks and videos. So this is the outfit, guys. 
oh, I love it. And I wore these earrings. I got these from Amazon. I love these earrings so much, but I'm ready to take off my makeup and go to bed and have an amazing day too. Because for me, like I wake up really early and I sleep early. So my thing is still sleeping eight hours, but I just need to go to bed. You know what I mean? I keep talking about it. So I'm going to go to bed, but I just want to show you guys my outfit. I really love it. It's from House of CB. It was just like really tight. So when I was walking, I was walking really slow. But yeah, the sex party was so fun, but I'm just ready to go to bed. Good night, guys. Day one hair by the Fakai team. You guys, Donovan just did my hair. This is Dell. And yeah, this is my first. Well, actually, it's day two of fashion week for me, but this is like my first day getting my hair done in New York City ah! oh my god I love it half up look and I'm gonna go to the Bronx and Bunko show right now but I gotta change oh my gosh I am loving it you guys know this is my favorite half up look I love it thank you so much and they're doing my hair like every day so you guys will see them in my vlog like every single day thank you love it okay gotta go there's so many shows and so many things I'm doing today so see you guys there bye okay so I am ready for the Bronx and Blanco show. That is the first show that I'm going to. This is day two of Fashion Week. Just got my hair done, wearing this House of CB dress. I'm gonna put in my little TikTok video I just made for the full OOTD because, I mean, you guys can see here. Okay, I'm ready for day two of Fashion Week. Dress is from House of CB. Bag is from Prada. Earrings are Alessandra Rich. Ring is from Meshki and hair done by Frederick Fakai's team, Donovan Maxwell. I love it. Oh, and then shoes are Jessica Rich. Ready to go to the Bronx and Bonko show. That is the very first show that I'm going to today. Obsessed with this little fit. See you guys there. This is the look. My little bathroom counter is a little bit messy. I have an eyeliner in my hand, but I gotta go. But this is the fit, and then my little Prada bag, but I'll show you guys more later. My what vlogging camera, shooting with Lonnie. You guys, she shot my Playboy shoot, like... That's how we met. Yes, years ago, yeah. and we are back in New York. Ah, I'm so excited to shoot with her. We're gonna shoot really quick, right here in this gorgeous archway thing by the pier, because I'm gonna go to the fashion show there. Excited. Ah! Opening the shades right now. Just got home to my room. Literally, I'm so excited to just like lay in bed for a second. I actually was supposed to go to this gifting suite, but girl, I can't even post IG stories or anything. So I went to a beauty event right after the Bronx and Bonco show. It was so good, you guys. Like it was so so good. I want everything from there. The lighting is giving. Like I look so like light compared to my body. I sat in the front row. Oh, I was so excited. I brought my vlogging camera, but I think I like thought I forgot it. Cause I was like, oh, I was like looking. And then honestly, I ran into so many friends and so many creators. I'm gonna insert them right here as well. And yeah, I was just like so excited to be there. And then after I went to a beauty brunch, the brand is called Amores. I have the makeup right here. You guys, it's a mess in here. Oh, fashion week is crazy. So I'm gonna get ready and then go to the Revolve Gallery. Then I'm gonna go to LeJohn's and then Rebecca Minkoff. So this was the dress that I wore to Bronx and Banco. I might still wear it later. I shouldn't be sitting on it. But fashion week is so amazing. I just love fashion week. I feel like it's probably one of my like most favorite weeks ever of like life. And I love New York City, but fashion week in New York is lit, 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 lit. So yeah, the clothes are amazing. Wanted everything. So hopefully I get to work with Bronx and Bunko in the future because I'm manifesting that. That is just like a brand that I really, really like. And I feel like I really, that's like my style, you know? So I hopefully, I get to work with them and wear one of their dresses. I originally was supposed to actually wear one of their outfits, but 
they ran out so um i think everybody in new york gotta wear all this stuff so yeah hopefully next year i get to wear one of their dresses so i actually wore this really cute house of cb dress that i love so much and i shot with my photographer lonnie lee who shot my playboy photo shoot like 2015 oh my gosh that's so long ago but yeah so oh my god it's been amazing i'm gonna actually take a little rest and post on stories and stuff like that because like i feel like between the shows if you do have a little moment i actually don't really have the moment but i am taking a moment like i finally you know get a post and stuff so i'm gonna do that because i got my hair done in the morning and i just want to put everything in that i did because i don't want them to think i forgot about them so all right guys i will talk to you later bye guys so i got my hair styled this morning but my hair was damp i washed my hair i'm just fixing one of the curls because it's like falling out a little bit but i wanted to have this like really pretty like blow dried look so that's what i got my room is a little bit crazy but it's day three of fashion week i brought my vlogging camera out to bronx and banco yesterday and i was telling this girl next to me because she had the same camera i was like oh i forgot my vlogging camera but i had it with me so crazy i didn't realize it so today right now i'm going to a presentation by patricia boto the show is or the brand is called one of this is my look you guys so i'm gonna wear these sunglasses i'm gonna just show you in the mirror because you know i can't really show you so i'm wearing these sunglasses i'm wearing these gold earrings I feel like the sunglasses are like the look wearing this white little ruffle revolved dress i'm gonna wear white tom ford heels and then i'll show you guys my um lady dior well i'm gonna grab it real quick and show you and then i'm gonna bring my lady dior and then i'm gonna head out so this is what i'm doing today hey guys what do you think about this morning look it's literally 9 a.m and i'm going to a presentation and i'm going to a bunch of stuff but it is going to be 80 degrees so i thought i would wear this dress from revolve sunglasses from sad ray sunglasses i love how big they are earrings are from galloway bag is lady dior from dior shoes are tom ford this is my day three look i'm changing in between but this is one of my looks i've already worn like a thousand looks in three days and this is just day three okay i will see you guys later bye Mwah. but yeah this is what I'm wearing. I know, I need to clean my room. I've been organizing my room every single day, like folding clothes little by little. And after I wear, I like put it away because I know I'm not gonna wear again, I think, because I brought so many looks anyways. But yeah, so day three of Fashion Week. It is so much fun, I love it. It's been on and on and on, but I actually slept last night. I skipped a show at night and then I ended up sleeping because I wanted to sleep because I had to be up at five to get the hair done. So Okay guys, so what is this Sunday? Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Okay, it's day four. All my days are mixed together. I'm walking to the gym, finally getting a workout and have not worked out for like four days. Probably, yeah, four days. So I'm ready to work out. Dog, walking to Dog Pound, but it's super close. So excited to get a pump in. You guys, this is my umbrella. Walking to Westville to get lunch. Just worked out at Dog Pound. And going to a fitting at one, so it's 12. So I'm gonna actually have to like be very New Yorker. Get my food, eat it really fast, and then keep walking. Loves it though, everything is close together, but this is my umbrella style. At the Courtney Kardashian fitting. Got my little bag with my outfit in it. And this is how a fitting sometimes looks like. Clothes out that we could choose from. That's like a rack that I chose from. And all the clothes are laid out here.
day five of new york fashion week just got my hair done by donovan from fakai dress is from house of cv i'm obsessed but the key is to have a tote and have shoes in there because you cannot wear heels like walking around to, from place to place and i always stay by like wherever fashion week is which is in spring studios and you need to have the shoes in a bag because you need to switch so i'm doing that and I'm walking to my first stop, which is Alo Yoga. New York Fashion Week, day five. Literally look number one million. Jacket is from Shein, Amazon. Top is from Honey Burdette. Score is from Revolve, MBD. Boots are Alexander McQueen, thigh high because I love them, I've had them forever. Bag is Amazon GWPEI, and earrings are also from Amazon. Hair I got done earlier by Donovan from Fakai, and that's my fit. Okay guys, help me get dressed for day five of New York Fashion Week. I just got my hair done, this really cute bun. So I think I'm gonna wear this really cute House of CV black dress. I'm gonna put on these boots. I think that is the look. So I think I'm gonna put on these pearl earrings for the look. And then I think I'm gonna add this Chanel pearl rhinestone choker. And then my bag, I'm gonna do this Amazon bag. And I think that's the look, I love it. Heading to the Akamas presentation. Sometimes it's so much traffic that it's actually faster to walk, but I'm wearing heels. I actually brought sneakers and a tote because that is just the key to traveling. But I didn't want to get like sweaty and hot when I arrived to the Akinbas. Afterwards I can, but this is like what we do. I mean like what we do. I'm only been here seven days, but I feel like I'm dealing with that a lot. Everyone's always honking and always like weaving in and out a lot. So I feel like I would never drive in New York, but we are heading to the presentation and I'm bringing my vlogging camera out, I promise, because I feel like I always forget to bring it out. And I'm always just like using my phone and doing stories. So this time I'm bringing out the vlogging camera and vlogging with this camera so you guys can see what a presentation looks like. It's not exactly a show, but there's like models wearing the clothing pieces and you see everything. Oh my gosh, guys, the show day is finally here for the Boohoo Kourtney Kardashian Barker show. I'm going today. I am all ready. I wore the fit. Sorry, it's a mess. And I saw Kourtney Kardashian and Travis Barker walking today when I was walking from a lunch meeting thing to my hotel. I saw them walking and I was like, oh my gosh. So yeah, they're here in town. So this is my fit. I'll show you guys a whole OTD when I get to the Highline, which is where the location is, but super excited to go. Oh my gosh, it's gonna be super lit. So yeah, oh my God, so excited. All right, see you guys there. So that is it for my New York Fashion Week video. It was so much fun. I have created so many memories and I can't wait to go back. I will be at the Fashion Week next year as well. And I'll actually be going back to New York very, very soon again because I just love that city so much. And I can totally see myself 
living there. Even though I have my healthy routine in LA and I'm such an LA girl, I can definitely see myself in New York as well. So it's just one of those things where I'm always dreaming of living there. But thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys liked it. If you guys want to see more videos like this or Glam Life Vlogs, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Click on the subscribe button below and also keep in touch with me on all of my other social media platforms. I love you guys so much and I'll talk to you guys and see you guys in my next video. Bye guys! Mwah.